Brianna. You're still lying. Brianna, wait. I don't want to hear it. I don't want to hear any more of your lies. This is another one of your games. You just think it's all a game. That's exactly what you think. You know what? Richard's way better off without you anyways. Don't even bother. You ready to party in Afghanistan, man? Yeah. Yeah, dude, I'm ready to blow Afghanistan. I think I'm just going to take a year off, party for a while, and just enjoy being out of high school. You're just lazy, Tiffany. By the time I graduate, you're still going to be partying in Bobby's. Ray, what are you doing here? I'm doing laundry. What does it look like I'm doing? Well, can't you come back later? We're kind of in the middle of something. Um, no. I need to do my laundry. Alright. What do you want? I'm not giving you any money. Friend, friend, why you gotta be such a pain in the butt for? Here's 20 bucks. Go buy something pretty. I know that golfing stuff. Whatever. Tiffany, you have to stop going to Bobby's. Guys, I really like going to Bobby's. He gives me free drinks and lets me in for free. Don't call me when you get shot. some meth waste lingering in your brain that's making you hallucinate. Why can't you just leave us alone? Mm, vroom vroom, you're such a pain in the butt. What'd you call me? I said you're a pain. What? No, 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 no. Vroom vroom. Nobody's called me vroom vroom since Marcus. I was just trying to get your attention. Okay, if somebody tried to kill you, why don't you go to the police? I can't go to the police. Somebody tried to kill me. Oh my god, Tiffany, you're alive. attacked you? Did you see his face? No, I couldn't see his face. He was wearing a mask and it's just all blurred in my head. Ugh. How much money did you owe, Bobby? Do I owe him money? You came to me a couple months ago asking for money. I mean, nothing. What's she gonna do for money? She burned her own bridges. Hang on a second, let me call you back. What's up? I have a small favor to ask you. Oh, what is it? I was wondering if I could borrow a little bit of money. Well, four free drinks? Oh, no. 
I'm clean now. For, since when? Like two months. So how much are you needing? <clears throat> $2,000. Dude, there's no way. There's no way. $2,000? Yeah. Much... I'll pay you back. Yeah, I've heard that before. Well, I know you like Marcus. What? I know you've been sending him emails, talking to him all the time, and he's going to be back, you know, from Afghanistan here in a couple of months, and I can totally set you all up. Well, why would you want to set me up with your ex? we're still friends. Come on. Let me, let me go get my wallet. The most I can do is 500 bucks. Okay. And you have to pay me back. I will. I swear. Okay. Just give me just a minute. I'll get, go get my wallet. <laughs> died when they're over in Afghanistan didn't even phase you. You didn't even show up at their funeral because you're so messed up. Please, girls, don't fight. Are you okay, Tiffany? I'm fine. I, I just need to go to the bathroom. Okay. Just a few more miles away. We're going to make it. Just hold on a little more. Yeah. Tell, tell, my, tell my parents I'm sorry. I'm so, so sorry that I didn't stay in contact with them while well, I've been here. And the best parents I could ever ask for. Tell, take care of my sister, man. Make sure. Make sure she doesn't take any jerks, man. Yeah. Do that for me, man. Now get out of here. It's my turn to get home some fire. Okay. Oh my God, I can't believe you're here. I thought you were missing. I saw some flyers with your picture on them. Uh, just needed some time. Oh, you've just... been gone such a long time. You're always working in the garden. I know, I love it. But it's 
Hard work now that Marcus is gone. He used to help me. And I know you miss him too. You yeah. two were so close. Yeah, I miss him, but like, everything will be okay. Well, I just came by to check on you. I've got to go do some things. Well, I'm so glad you stopped by. It was so good to see you. I know. I'm so glad that I saw I'm you. I'm glad too. you're doing okay. Take care now. Be careful and come back. Come back and see me. Bye. Explain. You're supposed to be dead. The military lied to y'all. Just, just let me explain to you, please. Somebody killed her. Oh, 
discharged from Afghanistan for not uh, completing one of our missions. And then we got uh, offered by the government uh, a new mission. They offered us to be part of a new project. We didn't know what we was getting into. They called it Project X. They were trying to create a new kind of super soldier with, with superpowers and super strength. Several soldiers died in the transition, but only 10 of us survived. But they gave us these pills, and then they stuck us in a cell and left us to suffer. And finally, this nurse, nurse, she felt sorry for us and she helped us escape. But on the way out, Toby got shot. And I made it out. I can't control it for too long. I dream of them chasing Tiffany. I come back trying to figure all this out, but I'm running out of pills, and I know they're after me. So you're a fugitive? I know this is a lot of stuff to take in, but you can't tell nobody. Please don't tell nobody. There's others just like me. This, this, this can't be real. This just can't be real. I can't handle this. So. So, so who killed Tiffany? Who killed Tiffany? I'm about to find out. I got to go to the woods. Is this the place? Yeah, this is the place. What is my mom doing here? Stay here. I don't want to be here left alone. I'm telling you to stay here. Okay, I guess. Fine. trying to escape. Stay tuned to watch preview of next week's episode of Fugitives. I'm real close to the house. Uh, 
Marcus told me you were dead. I miss you too, kid. Marcus. Marcus. another one of your games. You just think it's all a game. That's exactly what you think. You know what? Richard's way better off without you anyways. Don't even bother. You ready to party in Afghanistan, man? Yeah. Yeah, dude, I'm ready to blow. <laughs> 